hi guys welcome to my channel Natalia here Lovecraft forever and we have um, unboxing to do with you today as you can see it's a big box and um, this is diamond paintings from dreamers design arrived uh, we have here let's throw this packaging good as always and we have a uh, two canvases in here now what happened first time when my package arrived for the review as uh, dream design ambassador uh, our wonderful canadian custom charged big money as a custom fee for being a product arrived from us to canada so uh, the company lovely uh told me they can um, pay me money back but i kind of refuse that i just say that's okay one time is fine it just next time if i order some different diamond painting you can put me some surprise in a box so that's what they did but they didn't pay me money back next time because um unfortunately dhl company in canada they charge custom fees if if a product arrive with this company so let's see what we have here and what kind of surprise we got in here my little girl really wanted one of the designs that of course we we looking through all the designs and she really really wanted well done that's the one this one guys beautiful gorgeous picture and she loved this design because there's a swan in it up there um you see how pretty and all those beautiful purples and pinks she loved purple color so she picked this one for herself and she says she will try i don't know <laughs> hopefully she will stick to it at least drill a little bit where it's easier so i uh and i have one more here that i'm gonna show you later on so if you didn't see my first unboxing you can see all the details up there and all the packaging and all the tools and how it's packed so as you can see i'm not gonna repeat myself again the two two design boxes arrive in the perfect shape so that's already good they always care about their shipments and they come in an extra box so your diamond painting box carry on not to get damaged so i'm gonna open this one because Catherine is really really want to see how this looks like on the inside and of course mommy say wait a minute let me unbox first okay let's check it out on the inside and i'm gonna tell you everything and again everything packed together in different bags so it's all sealed and protected just for in case okay so i have here two different sizes so we can kind of compare them at the same time because my first canvas that i did my rainbow falls it was 50 by 40 so this one will be oh my god it's gonna be so fun with this color of gems as you can see they have a roll which is protect your diamond painting manual in 12 different languages now what we want to see is the canvas I'm gonna flatten out canvas first so we can see better and to do so we're gonna peel gently one side of the canvas and 
place it back tightly sometimes even if I use my roller it's even kind of even easier to place this uh, mat back let me just do second see it's already kind of flatten out more that's what it's good about this canvas is it's easy to handle okay what we see here perfect perfect condition not one crease nothing and you can believe your eyes right all perfect and now I'm gonna show you well let me see first okay I want to see the print wow okay um, so I will say this canvas icons even better than my first one was wow very good clarity um well here watch for yourself look how clear every single icon everything this is going to be so easy for her to do she's only 10 so she's definitely gonna enjoy with this canvas very very clear even like in here top of the tree that is red colors look how everything is perfect wow this is beautiful this is beautiful guys and i can't wait to see this tree in the spring colors and purples it's going to be so beautiful so now let's see what we have in here i'm going to put this for you like this or maybe this is going to blind you okay let's flip upside down for now that way our canvas will straighten up a little bit better and check it out so we have the same thing as first kit because all kits is the same they have a two pencils well pen stylus pen with the same of the five placer or six placer man I never remember say I think it's six placer and the uh, three placer which this one is my favorite you know if you know me long enough but oh guys uh, before I forget uh, for the last month I want to welcome all my 300 subscribers thank you so much for trusting my channel for joining me and I'm just so welcome to have you here thank you thank you very much so let's see our little spongy let's see if this one fit maybe better because last time if you saw my unboxing it was kind of slipping away okay this is definitely it's still sliding but if I pull a little bit down it's it's kind of sticking in here it's sturdy in here so it's gonna hold it to it so I wonder if they um, sometimes can be bigger and smaller. But anyway, now we have a amazing another tool. And to be honest, I'm just getting lucky to have all these cups broken all the time in my kids. <laughs> so this is no exception. Cup is broken, but that's okay. Not a big deal. I have lots of more of this one. Okay, from um, I have this protector more from my different diamond paintings, so that's not big deal. It's still holding the sharp pieces inside, and then we have awesome tray. I don't know why I show you again because we already did our first unboxing and beautiful, beautiful packaging for our wax. So this was our first unboxing tools from this kit. Now we're gonna check our beautiful beads. And let's just show you guys. I never kind of mentioned uh, this canvas is called Twisted Blossom. 
from Anne Marie Bone. She's a beautiful, beautiful artist. And if you can Google, I'm sure you can find lots of her art. She's very, very talented. And the canvas size in here, hold on, I'm going to show you close up. 40 by 30 printed area of the canvas. Okay, now the moment of beautiness, it's the drills. Wow, look at this beautiful pink. Oh, so pretty. So pretty colors. Okay, let's enjoy a little bit of the sparkles of colors. Look how gorgeous. There. I have lots of black beads left from my first design, so now I, I'm sure I'm gonna have more. And I'm just so glad to have leftovers of these beads because they are high quality drills. There. Oh boy, I love these pinks together. This one. Look how beautiful they uh, shade together each other. And then pretty yellow. And beautiful, beautiful baby purple. Very beautiful. So we have here, let's see how many colors we have on this canvas. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 19 colors. 19 colors. And here's the all the symbols. Everything clear as a whistle. That's how I say <laughs> Okay, so this was our first canvas. So let's check it out what I picked to drill for myself. I'm gonna put this aside in here and we're gonna open I'm not gonna show you box just to keep you anticipation yours to see what's gonna be on the inside So this canvas same size as was my first unboxing. This one would be 50 by 40. And nothing inside. Let's see this kit. Kit, what do you want to see first? Drills or canvas? <laughs> I think we want to see canvas, right? Then we will see the drills. Okay, so let's do that. So everything should be the same, drills and um, all the tools, same thing, manual, in different, uh, in different languages. And then, uh, should I show you on the box picture or are we going to recognize this picture like this? Okay, same thing on the foam roller. Do you remember this picture? I'm gonna show you, actually not on a box, but I'm gonna show you here on the canvas, the picture of this diamond painting. I'm all about the color, and I think these colors are so vibrant and bright, and I like to work with bright colors. And here's the name. Elysian Bridge Diamond Painting by same artist I love her and Marie Boone and this is 50 by 40 drilling size of the canvas so let me straighten up a little bit and then we're gonna see uh, icons 
if they are same good quality or not let me just peel it and just guys always be careful with the clear sheet to press exactly same way as you peeling out and I will repeat this in my every almost single video about that because if you stick your sheet in the opposite size in an opposite side it will stick and you will not get out of the canvas so protect yourself and not to make this mistake okay canvas itself doesn't have a wrinkles only a uh, marking from the wrinkles from this paper from uh, well, it created wrinkles on the paper but not on the canvas which is always good okay so let's straighten up this way a little bit now Okay, I honestly don't understand what people complain about. Okay, I'm going to show you there's lots of negativities and wrong information, guys. So I want you to say that you can see for yourself. Here is closed up. Do you think this canvas icon is clear enough for you to drill? In my first canvas, the only I would suggest it to the company when you have a mm, patches like this of the dark color, which in this case, uh, in my um, rainbow falls was black. In here is the um, blue. So let me check on the blue. Okay, the blue would be much easier than black because you still can see the squares on it but uh, my suggestion was in my other canvas that to make this not a solid color but even with the dot on the top that would be make it much better if you have a big area of the same color but you can see here squares anyway all those lines grid and the black one was a little bit more harder but that's the only thing they need to uh, work it out on it and i don't see this as very big problem as I drill over my light pad and it was work for me perfectly fine and rest of the design you don't have to believe my words you can believe your eyes okay I can show you and you can decide for yourself and I think this canvas doesn't have a blurry icons do you see any blurry icons because I don't see it in my opinion they are clear so i'm really super excited to start on this canvas as soon as possible um and to answer your questions to some of you how come i did my diamond painting so fast uh, i will um, explain in a professional way uh, if you choose to be ambassador brand ambassador for the company it means you should do your kind of job professionally and review your can canvas as soon as possible to promote company to you know, because especially when company is young only you know months old if not so you you need to kind of drill faster to spread the word around the internet about this company and that's how i do with every company i promote okay uh, you have to drill fast put away aside the other stuff and do what you supposed to do to make uh, you as a professional brand ambassador but when i received my first brand ambassador canvas I was not asked to do video at all or even promote that was as up to me if I want to do it or not 
but honestly they did not push me to do that that was my uh, how would I say my love to diamond painting and I finished it in three days because it was such an easy canvas to work with beautiful vibrant colors and so I'm just gonna clear that and why I receive my canvases so fast because company DHL ship from US to Canada in three days guys it's even faster than for US but then there's a price on the end that they charge custom fees for Canadians which is a little bit sad so I hope one day we will have um, canvases shipped from Canada to Canadians and that's my uh, big concern and I have been keep asking a company to please do somebody um, to ship from Canada to Canadians so we don't have to pay extra money because it's not cheap okay the colors the colors okay so how many colors we have on this one I'm sure you already saw a whole bunch of um, unboxing of this canvases and you already uh, see from our friend ambassadors girls uh, reviewing this images already but I'm just gonna do for myself because this canvas first for me okay and I want to know how many colors I have here so let's count together one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty one two three four five six seven so 27 colors I think my last canvas was 23 colors so this one has definitely more colors I'm happy about that and let's see let's see some drills we're not gonna um, I don't know you want me to show you guys drills all the way around you know what I want to show you? I'm going to show you right now. Like right now. Okay. I'm going to pull out tray. And one of my subscribers asked me. She's been drilling for quite a bit, for a long time. And she cannot put her drills nicely to the tray like I do. So she asked me, please, can you do a tutorial how you're doing it? So I'm going to do right now. My dear friend, this is for you. So I put sometimes, well, let's see, this amount of beads on my tray. So it's pretty much like a half of the tray. I'm holding my finger on the inside not to let beads slip from here. I do like this. And I do shaking it from side to side, very gentle, doing it from left to right, a little bit like this, wiggling right and shaking at the same time. And I do it, do it, do it. And then I put kind of beads to this corner, to the side, shaking on an angle. And then I put beads vertical, a little bit tray, and top it. The beads from here will fall down and make this beautiful line okay so that's how i do how i line up my beads i hope this helped now there's the other way so let's mix it up this kaylin do our okay sorry my video stopped uh our brand ambassador kaylin she do it kind of easier even way and I like the way she does she holding her finger in here to close this part of the tray and like this and she's shaking this way forth and back so when you do this your drills flipping to this corner you can even put them on this corner left over and you have already line in here or you can just slightly shake and you have beautiful lines again so there's a two way and i'm doing a both right now and this way probably going to be easier for beginners because your beads not gonna slip away from from this little neck line you just shake it and they just will fall in a line by themselves 
you don't even need to work hard for it so that's how I do so now I have a bits in here that I need to put in a tray before I spill them all over and we're just gonna see a little bit of the different colors see if it's any new colors of the drills in here okay I'm gonna put this aside so I don't spill and we're gonna check these colors gorgeous pink I think it's the same pink that I had before uh, may, no this one a little bit different reddish this pretty pretty green oh my god this blue is so my color um, I would love to have a dress in this color it would match to my blue eyes this one pretty just the two together beautiful and this two together make my Ukrainian flag yay <laughs> okay now here is we have two bags I guess of each color yes two bags of each color of this green focus there and a little bit lighter in here then we have another bag of tritan for me if I see tritan if 310 beads perfect condition then you know for sure all your colors will be beautiful because 310 is the worst beads in the diamond painting history and we all know this but usually if your beads came in a strip of, of like this in one strip they usually always higher quality beads than those that you receive in a uh, single packaging those ones usually are less quality and I already uh, kind of um, how I would say uh, well I, I have lots of those diamond painting that I drill already with the single packages usually they would be short on the drills uh, instead like this packaging only uh, have like in dreamer designs we have 20 percent more uh, beads of each color for your canvas some company do up to 40 so this is definitely will be enough beads to drill and i did my review of uh, rainbow falls that i did have left lots of lots of beads guys so you will not have a shortage of beads with this company dreamers designs my family and I love them to bits and it's not because I am a brand ambassador it's because I'm a true reviewer and I speak up from my heart the way I see it and I always show to you close up so you can see for yourself okay and if you don't believe me please order for yourself and you will enjoy with this diamond paintings so my little girl gonna love this one she loves swans do you have a time for a funny story okay I'm gonna show you tell you right now when my little girl she was very very young I was kind of like carrying her in my hands yet um, she didn't walk yet I think we went to cemetery to visit grandparents and there is a couple of swans up there always come it's like a little pond up there and a pair of swans always would make a nest up there and that time a period of time where we went they did have a little a nest with the eggs in it so we did not see the eggs but we saw the little baby swans later so the father swan would protect uh his woman swan she would be sitting on a on a nest and he big huge would be walking around make sure nobody gonna get there and it's kind of like a little island in the middle of the um, water so me curious of course I wanted to come a little bit more close and throw them a little bit of food you know I'm trying to be kind Swan did not like it oh my god he chased me 
I do have somewhere video. I might gonna find it and show it to you. He chased me. I'm running with, with my baby Catherine and my hands running to the car and he opened his wings. It was huge. So as soon as I closed door behind me in the car, he started biting tires of the car. He was chasing me. He was so mad that I would hurt his family. So this swan represent um i would say uh how would they say it's a love loyalness to his partner that he would protect no matter what and you know when swans losing a uh, other couple i mean the other um of his half they usually always stay alone so every year we kind of go and watch the swans and it's a beautiful view the way they sometimes come to the pond and swim with the babies but they come over every single year so that's the story totally not related to the unpacking but <laughs> it is swan in here and it's kind of got to my mind and i decided to share with you because that was funny how we run away from the father swan he was mad so guys i thank you oh i wanted to show you my finished project uh for those who didn't see i already put in a box oh just a minute guys just a minute i kind of put away already but i remember in my last video i told you that i'm gonna show you for those who did not see it so I will show you. So that's how I store right now. I, oh my God, look at the sparkle. You see that? Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Quality of the drills. Um, when you finish your diamond painting and you want to roll to store, always roll diamonds on a top, not inside on a top. Because if you roll inside out, the drills would push each other and pop them out. This way they spread in nicely with those lines and it's good to go anytime you are ready to frame. So here it is guys. Believe your own eyes. Do you see what I see? How people cannot to love this? I do not understand. This is gorgeous. See how sparkle? And I have only like a little light from the top, but if you didn't see my video when I recorded this on a sun sunlight dashing through my window, oh my god, that was so beautiful. So this is the one Rainbow Falls. And I will not pronounce name because I'm gonna kill it. I'm not good in French, so you can check this out here. And here is the original painting. And that's how it's look like. I um, absolutely love it. Okay, so we have here a little bit of the unboxing. We have a little bit of the tutorial. Um, yes, the tools with this kit, the same thing. And we even have a little bit of the story and finished project review. So I think we cover a lot today. And oh my God, guys, this is my cup that is not broken. Yay, finally, <laughs> finally. But yes, I would love to see Dreamer design on a Twizzer logo. That would be awesome. So thank you so much, Dreamer Designs, for these beautiful canvases. I love it. And I will start on them soon as possible because I want to. Because I want to. Because I want to see all those pink colors. Here is more kind of was like a green and blue. The other one pink and purples. And I cannot wait to start. So thank you so much for being with me with my unboxing. I hope you like it, what I showed you. And uh, check it out, please, our ambassadors and Dreamer Designs on uh, Instagram and Facebook group. We do have a live chat streams with Kaylin uh, on every Thursday and Sunday. It's uh, Eastern 8 o'clock p.m. time and five o'clock would be in the other how would you say oh my god okay um well five o'clock and eight o'clock and eastern so you figure out because i'm a blind uh moment right now 
Okay. <laughs> Whew, I'm out of my breath because I try to talk so fast. Okay. So guys, if you want to see me to, uh, am I gonna do right now to separate my beads into the containers? And if, if I feel like I should add the video to this video, kind of organizing together, I might well be, but I'm not sure. So for now, I'm gonna say thank you so much. Thank you for joining me. I love you all. Treat each other with kindness and spread kind words to everyone. Kindness will win. Thank you very much. Okay, guys, I decide to continue my video and we're gonna organize this bit together with you. Just if you wanna stay longer. So I'm gonna do first uh, from my little girl Twisted Blossom image. So I'm gonna flip this inside out so we have a clear field to work with and I already you see my fancy organizers from before right uh, free one okay so that's important I already pre-mark all the call I mean number DMC that I need in here and now I'm just gonna grab this gorgeous drills and we're gonna place them one by one in my um, jars also i'm just gonna show you what uh, what is going on here around let me just flip my tripod on this side and as you can see i have tons of these bottles laying here around okay uh, it's a uh, leftover from my previous designs and so i kind of like when i finish drill canvas um, I don't wipe the number uh, I just leave it like this and then when I drill again and if I have same DMC code I just find the jar with the same number and it's good but if you don't have it you can easy clean this with um, this one uh, get yourself a nail polish remover it's a pure acetone 100% and it's work wonderful to clean up your permanent marker work really good so that's what I did on my containers in here I cleaned them and I put right numbers what I did not have so now I'm just gonna grab one by one what I have in here and we will organize together if you have nothing to do and if you have diamond painting, you can drill and let's talk maybe, I don't know. I just want to see together all these beautiful colors. So my first one is gorgeous purple. It's 554. So I think, like I'm not going to use Ziploc because it's faster for me to do in a uh, from this kind of easier access to put on my uh, rotator from coffee holder so I'm just gonna open and I'm not gonna even use my tray because it should be no problem to go right inside in this container it's not static at all as you can see it's my jar could be make them static later but for now uh, none beads is sticking to my container so I'm just click and put in my uh, carousel next color beautiful 3078 here's my 3078 nice 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 I have feeling that I think I'm gonna do this diamond painting because my little girl she told me her secret how she tricked me and I'm gonna tell you <laughs> that she's like 
okay mom if I'm gonna tell you to buy certain diamond painting you might not gonna pick but if I like it you will pick from me and then you know she's just gonna let me do it she just wants to have it but she don't want to drill but she still wants to have a certain picture because she like it and she know if she like it that I would order for her yes that's what she did with this one so I will see how much she gonna drill okay make sure we have it okay I'm already messing up hold on oh, uh, no it is it's a 6 or 3 no I'm right hopefully I'm not gonna chat to you and mix up the numbers now I'm doing great next 602 I know it's not very presentable to use these containers but if you know me long enough I always kind of look in solution for you as much as possible to be cheap or free so this is one of them to keep it free if you if someone in your family has a health problem then you can use these containers otherwise you can use containers like this one for example you can find them at the dollar store pack of 20 or 15 I'm not sure right now but I got them from a restaurant for free they use them for sauces and um, sour cream stuff like that uh, you just ask them if you can have some they have stashes of empty clean containers spray new one I'm not talking about used one okay so that's the other way for you to have an organizer for you so now okay I'm just keep here in my phone um, okay that's my family teasing me and since I have my phone uh, somebody asked me where I got the spinner guys it's uh, I bought the, this in Canada on festival uh, but definitely you can find this kind of stuff in China there's lots of different spinners on Aliexpress if you're interested okay so <laughs> that's a uh, satisfying and it's bling it losing a little bit it was silver silver losing a color as you can see but it's pretty okay so let's do it I know this is totally out of topic but I just remember so if I remember somebody ask me some questions I'm trying to guys get to all of you with my answer so I hope um, my lovely subscriber she will see this video and find the spinner because I find this satisfying and it's kind of comfortable to hold the cell phone so you don't drop off your hands and if you're very very bored you just play with the spinner 498 okay uh, just remind me to check on the colors okay 553 553 Oh, so pretty very pretty color I can't wait now I'm kind of hope my little girl say come on mom you can drill it's okay and I'm just like yes <laughs> now this one is 552 I hope you're not tired from me yet. You see each bag, there's no static in these bags. Awesome. I love them because I thought I will have a static drill, so I have a sheet, dryer sheet next to me just for in case, but so far so good. It's the containers lately can be static and make your beads jump all over but to prevent them for example okay trick 10 to prevent that if you have 
any kind of containers you just you just grab the dryer sheet and just rub it on the inside and lid and then you know for sure your beads not gonna be sticky anymore not sticky but static I don't remember if I saw anybody finish this diamond painting yet. I have to look online and see. That would be fun to see how this looks like finished. I'm sure somebody already finished somewhere up there. I just cannot remember. Eight, eighteen. This one is so beautiful, baby pink orangey i don't even know how to call this name um color of this drills very very pretty okay Okay, guys, just a minute. My phone is calling. Just a minute. Okay, sorry about that. I have to pass it because my family keep calling me. And I muted my phone. And it just keep buzzing and buzzing. They went, uh, my husband took kids to the falls for some fun time. And while it's nice and quiet, that's why I record a video right now. <sighs> okay. No more distraction, okay? Eight, fourteen, yep. Next one. Beautiful. Kind of look like a red or pink. Uh, this light kind of make a color not as true color. This one is 600. It's a pretty color. This one is really bright orange. And I picked the most colorful pictures. I love colors. As much as I like neutral and soft colors, at the same time, I am a big fan of colors. I love colors. Ooh, we can't miss that bead out, one bead up there in the bag. We cannot miss that out. Come here. And this is 814. 814. Every drill is precious. We're not gonna miss that. My finger all black from ink because I was using my uh, acetone to remove some numbers and that's why it went through. I kind of forgot to use my fancy uh, tool that uh, I use sometimes to grab my cotton ball and wipe it so I don't have to use my fingers and not ruin my uh, manicure but I forgot this time okay I'm a human okay what we have next 38 30 I don't know if everybody like to watch this this kind of video of me just putting drills into the containers it's probably not as much fun 
because I don't talk too much of the stories because I need to concentrate so I don't mess up with the color DMC numbers but if you do like this kind of video then let me know and I will together with you organize my other canvas that we just unboxed okay 741 741 there this carousel are so handy so if you are a coffee lover and you have this carousel turn it into the drills carousel double check yes I don't know if a uh, spices rock would fit uh, for this kind of uh, con containers I'm not sure uh, for the smallest one maybe but I have like two sizes as you can see how much this one is wider would be but for the coffee holder uh, carousel fit perfectly so we have here beautiful 820 nice blue blue color there gorgeous oh my god I love this color and I see that my container has leftover drills bits from different painting looks like around drills was here and a little bit dirty so I have to unstatic them first and as you can see uh, their camera they all came out nicely so 920 never forget to check it out the links under the video sometimes you can find handy dandy links also it's gonna be linked to the dreamer designs website which is www.dreamersdesigns.com 787 You can join my Instagram, Lovecraft Forever XO, so you can uh, kind of, you will know first scoop if I upload some video or I have some news, I'm usually uploading to my Instagram. So this beautiful yellow is a 725 pretty I think it's a same color that we drill with you in my previous video seven twenty five seven twenty five okay. Wow I'm surprised there's a zero static usually uh, some, some bags could be very static this one is not so we have two more left 550 8.65 um, I don't know when I was looking on this number after my I kind of forgot to mention this that 38.65 look exactly for me like 2500 number uh, does anybody else think the same thing or maybe I just didn't don't have this number maybe shading are so close to each other uh, I don't have a if I have in my stash 
3865 but they are really look like to me as 2500 so tell me in the comments if it's a big difference in the color between them okay and we finish clean my working space and now we have our old beads organized usually in this carousel I start on the bottom of my carousel I start like from the lowest number and go in order and then if I don't have a room anymore on the first level the next up number would go on the second layer and go all the way around and the highest beads of the number would be on a top row as like 37, 38, 30, 100, uh, I mean stuff like that. So that's how I organize and it's very easy accessible for me to look for the number. Doesn't take much space in my desk, on my desk by computer. So that's great and because of this canvas is a little, it will fit perfectly on my desk while I'm watching YouTube, watching your videos, enjoying your videos. For somebody who drilled too, okay, I'm showing you upside down, sorry. There. So my next one, probably gonna be this one. If my little girl tell me, go ahead and do it, mom. Um, I will thank you today, guys, for visiting my channel. And thank you for all your love and support and comments. And, um, if you have any questions, as usual, shoot them in my uh, under the video, and I will answer when I have time. I think uh, I might miss some on my older video. Sometimes YouTube hides in some comments, and when I refresh, I kind of see new comments popping up on some sometimes in a very very old videos. Uh, but I try to catch up today and lots of comments and I will do so. So if you have any help, any concern, any question of the tutorials, uh, please do it. And I do mark all your um, requests about tutorials, guys. I do write them down and I will do as much as possible. I'm trying to kind of as you can see I upload video like every day because I'm trying to not to be behind too much there's so many videos that I like to share with you there is not enough time of the day you know what I mean <laughs> so thank you so much dreamer designers for dream designers for this beautiful canvases both of them and thank you guys for watching I hope this video wasn't too long for you and I will see you in my next video.